Kain Okay, children, we'll just wait for a few more minutes so that all can join and we'll start, right? Yes, sir. Good evening, ma'am. Okay, children. Good evening to all of you. You can please put down your videos. Please put your videos on. Keep your videos on. My camera is not working. Okay, what about others? Yes, very good, Samya. What about others? Please keep your videos on. Yes, Ritesh, good. Hamza, keep your video on. I mean, it's on, just the background. But I can't see you. Where are you? Where are you, Hamza? Yes. I don't want to see the background. I want to see you. Your video is very blurred. Your camera good evening. is... Good evening, Meta. It's blur, Bachi. And because that, that's because of sunlight. Okay. So is my screen visible to you or that's also coming blur? Mom, your screen, your screen is visible. I'm visible. Uh, no, I'm asking Hamza because he's facing sunlight there, no? Hamza, is the, my screen clear to you? Yes, ma'am, it's clear. Okay. Okay. Soumya, keep your video on. Rishit's video is not working. Rayansh, keep your video on. Rayansh, Gelda, please keep your video on. Mom, just a minute. I'll get my book. Okay. Okay, children. So, in the previous class, yesterday, day before yesterday, uh, we did about mean and mode, is it? Yes, children. You remember what is mean, what is mode, what is mean? Mean is average. Yes, ma'am. Mean is average. You know, we find the average of something. If we have um, uh, two numbers, we find the average of that number. So we add up those numbers and we divide by the uh, whatever was the Num suppose if the numbers are there are two numbers we add the two numbers and we divide it by two and if we want to find the mean of three numbers then we add the three numbers and divide by three okay so we did so many examples based on it okay getting marks of uh, different five children suppose so we took marks of five children we added them and we divided by five so that was we were finding the mean right and we did mode also. In mode, what did we see? The maximum occurrence. The number which had maximum occurrence is mode. Okay. 
Are you understanding? Yes. Was this we did yes, in the sir. previous class. Okay. And today we are going to do about the median part. Okay. The median. Now, what is median? I'm sharing the screen now. Let's look at that. So this was mean, mode, digit. Okay, now median is, I'll tell you, median is the middle value. You know, in general terms, we say median is the middle value. Now, how do we find the middle value? Today is 26. Okay. Median. Median gives us the middle value, right here, middle value, okay, middle value. Now, if I take middle value, suppose I have, uh, I'm just taking an example, I'm just taking an example of median to explain you how do we find the middle value of that. Okay, now suppose, I have to find the median of this observation. I have so many numbers here, say 5, 13, 8, 9, 14, 17, 21, 4, 15, okay? So these are the numbers I have. How many numbers are these? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, nine. 8, 9. These are 9 numbers, okay? So my first step will be to arrange it in order. Either you arrange it in ascending order or you arrange it in descending order. So first thing is, as we were doing for mode also, you arrange them in order. So arrange in ascending order. I'm doing in ascending order. So tell me, when I arrange it in ascending order, what will I get? Soumya will tell me. Soumya, tell me in ascending order, what should I write first? Ma four. Four. Then five. Five. Then eight. Then nine. Then thirteen. Thirteen. Then fourteen. Fourteen. Then fifteen. Fifteen. Um seventeen. Very good. Then twenty one. Twenty one. Very nice. Very good, beta. Okay, so this is arrange, arranging in ascending order. Okay, now how many observations are these? What are the number of observations? Number of observations means how many are these? How many numbers are these? Pritej? How many observations are these? I'm like number. Yes, how many numbers are these? Nine. Under nine. They are nine. nine. So, Mom. observation I write as with the symbol N. Nine. Okay? Observations I'm writing with N. So, that means N is 9. Okay? Yes. Now, if I have to find the middle value. Now, see, this is the arranged order. If I have to find the middle value, what do you think the middle value will be? If I want to, these are 9. So, if I take 4 on this side and 4 numbers on this side, that means I get my middle point as this. Is it? Four yes, ma'am. That, that means equal distribution is done on both sides, is it? Yes. Understanding? Yes. Huh. So, but here what we see, these are just nine numbers. So we could find out the four numbers se chhodte, four numbers se chhodte, and we get the middle value because the list of numbers is so small, just nine numbers are there. But what if you have a list of so big numbers, hundreds and thousands of numbers? Then how will you find the median? So, in that case, we generate a formula. Okay? Uh, n plus 1 divided. Yes. Very good. Okay. So, in that case, we generate some formula 
suppose we have some odd number of suppose uh, number of observation is odd so in that case what do we do median is given with the formula you must keep this formula in mind okay median is given with the formula n plus 1 by toth term this is term not number this is term term means each number is one term here okay this is one term. I'm calling each number as term. These are nine terms. Okay. So that means the median will be the n plus one term. So what is n here? Nine. Ten. Ten divided by ten two. One by two. So that means ten this term. Ten by two that is five. And the answer is five. Five. So that is five. fifth term. Now, how will I find fifth term? Okay, first term, second term, third term, fourth term, and here I get my fifth term. Okay, you understood? Yes, yes children. You understood how did I got the fifth term? Yes. Uh, so, I have yes, an example on a short list of numbers. But if I have some very big numbers, you know, long list of numbers, then my formula will come there. Okay? Now, so now here the list of numbers had just nine uh, terms. Okay, what if I have some even number of terms? If suppose I have some even number of terms, then what will I do? Let's. I will that. directly divide by. Let's see. See for even number of terms, I'll tell you what we uh, we should do. Median. This was median for odd terms. Okay or number of terms. This was the formula that we use in when we have odd number of terms. So when we have even number of terms, then what formula do we apply? Even number of terms. Ab aap khud dekho, even number mein kya hota? Agar suppose, let's take this above example only. Okay? 4, 5, what are the numbers? Here, I am taking this example 4, 5, 8, 9, 13, 14, 15, 17, 29. These are the numbers, no? Commas are there in between. Okay. So, I what will I do? I will leave four numbers from here. Okay. Four numbers from here. Okay. So, that means equal distribution is there. But I suppose if I have another number here. Okay. 10 numbers. I want some even list of numbers, no? So, what will I do? I will leave 4 numbers from here. Okay, 4 from here. Okay, here na 4. Okay. But now, I have 2 numbers left in the middle. Now, what to do with 2, two numbers? 2 numbers cannot give me the median, no? Is it? Can I, have I got yes, the middle of this? No. So, what will I do? I must get some middle value here which lies between 13 and 14. So, what will I do? 13.5. So, uh -huh. so, since the numbers are small, you are quickly telling me 13.5. So, how do we get that 13.5? So, this is this term is the n. This term is n by 2th term. This term is the fifth term. So, this was n by 2th terms. Look here. Now, here my number of terms is 10. Is it? So, my formula will be n by 2th term. n by 2th term. Plus n by 2 plus 1th term. Divided by 2. This will be my formula. n by 2th term. 10 terms hai aur uska jo fifth part hai that is this is the n by 2th term that means it's this is the fifth term and this is n is equal to 10 by 2th plus 1 term plus 1 karenge to ye wali term aagi are you understanding this is number 14 is it yes ma'am yeah this is number 14 here and this was the fifth term and this was the this was the fifth term okay 
and this is the sixth term. Sixth term. Okay, that's why we call it n plus one, n by two plus one term. Are you understanding? Yani ki ye dono numbers ko jab hum plus karenge, eighteen plus fourteen divide by two. So we will get the number thirteen point five. Okay. This is what it actually means, which is given by this formula. So in the even list of numbers, when you have two numbers in the center place, you take the mean of those two numbers. Okay. Mean to pata hai aapko? You know mean? So you take the mean yes. of these two numbers. So you add both these two numbers, you divide by two. Okay. okay. So for the two mid middle values, you take the mean of these two numbers. Right? So that is given with the formula n by n by two -th term plus n by two plus one -th term, right? I hope it's clear to everyone. Yes, ma'am. Yeah. Ma'am, can you explain me again once? Okay. Now see, Ashwat, when you ma'am have... only even. Ha, only even when you have even list of numbers. No, if you have even suppose you have numbers eight. In your list, number 10, 10 numbers in your list, 12 numbers in your list, even number of list. So, your middle number comes, your middle center numbers are always 2 there. You will never find one number in the middle. Okay? If you have to divide it equally, you will never find one single number in the middle. Okay? You will all... Ma'am, this formula is only for even. This is only for even. Okay. okay. So, for even list of numbers, you will just get two numbers in the middle. So, when you find the mean of these two numbers, you get the exact middle value, the median. Okay? Yes, sir. Understood this? Ma'am, uh, you are telling n is equals to 10 by 2. That one I am not getting. Ah, this is given by the formula, actually. This is a formula. But in general way, we, give, we see... That when you have two numbers in the center place, you just take the mean of those and you get your median. That's it. Right? Anyone has doubt? Okay. Anyone have any doubt here? Okay, I'm giving you sums. Today we'll practice sums on mean, median, and mean. So we have done all the three concepts here now. So we'll do lots of sums on this. Okay. So let's take another example of okay. Okay. Note down the question. This is question number one. Please mute. Sharvik. There is disturbance. The scores in mathematics. The scores in mathematics test out of 25 Please note down the question also. I don't know whether you have this question in your book or not, but I am giving you this question, so please note down. Okay, the scores in mathematics test out of 25 of students is as follows. That is 19, 25, 23, 20, 9. You must write the numbers carefully. If you do mistake in just writing any of the numbers, you will get your wrong answer then. Okay, so be careful while writing. Advika, are you doing? Advika? Yes, ma'am. Uh, please do better. Find the mode. See, in this question, you I'm giving you two things. Find the mode and median of this data. Okay. And tell me, are they same? Okay. Will you do this? 
Now, how do you find mode? Uh, Ma'am, the maximum of it. Uh... Yes, absolutely. Very nice, Ashwat. So, the very first thing that you do, you arrange it in order. Either you arrange it in ascending order or you arrange it in descending order. Right? That is your first thing. So, please arrange it in order first. And count the number of observations that's there. These are numbers. Okay, so that's odd number. Please find the more. First, arrange it in order and see what do you get the maximum number of times. Okay, I'll show you this question, okay? So please listen here. So if I arrange it in ascending order, now who will tell me the ascending order of this? And Advika, tell me, how do I write in the ascending and order? I'm just arranging it. Uh -huh. Tell me. Okay. Five. Five. Nine. Mm -hmm. Ten. Ten. 12. Uh, yes. Um, next, it's 16. 16. Okay, we have 15 also here. 19. 16, then 19. Then uh, 20. Then 20. Again 20. Again 20. And more 2 times 20. 2 times 20 more? And how come like... How many 20s are there? 1, 20, 20, 20, 3, 20, 4, 20. No, 4, 20. Yeah. I told the same. Okay. Good. And next. then next is 23. 23. 24. 24. 25. 25. Again, 25. Very nice, Arvika. Great beta. So, you should. Ma'am, the 20 is the more. Ma'am, uh, I had network issues. What are we doing? We are not audible. Okay, children, let's do this power cut my side. Hello. Ma'am, I have lost yes. the internet. Um, can you tell what we are doing? Um, we, who is this? Ma'am, it's Ritej. Okay, Ritej, we are doing a question on mode and median. Okay, this is the question I have given. 
Before that, we discussed about median. What is median? Right? This you have attended. Now, this is the question I have given in which you have the list of numbers is given. You have to Nine. find mode and median of this data. So, first we arranged all these numbers in ascending order. Okay? Okay. Yes. The mode is uh, 20 uh, and the medium is 8. 8 term. Medium, median, n, median. Median. The maximum occurrence is of this number. This number you can see it's occurring maximum number of times. Is it? Four times. So the number which occurs maximum time is the mode. Right? Okay, now to find the median. How do we find the median? When we have number of observations. N plus 1 divided by 2. Now we have odd numbers. So, we, it is given by the formula. Yes, very nice. Ashwat, very good. So, n plus 1. Hello, ma'am. Ma'am, you are not audible. Ma'am, left. Yeah, ma Okay. Yes, children, are you there? Yes, ma'am. Okay, children, my side there is power cut now. Okay, so anytime my connection can go. Okay. Okay, ma'am. Yes. Ma'am, even my connection is going on. Because the, uh, I have a power cut my side. Okay. So if it goes, then class time is almost getting over. Then we'll continue in the next class tomorrow. Right. Okay, ma'am. So till we have some little bit connection, let's. Do the sum. Ma'am, n is equals to six. Uh, fifteen. Fifteen plus 15 one divided by two. So fifteen plus one divided by two, we get sixteen by two, which is equal to eight. So that means this is the not number eight. This is the eight term. Okay, yes. this is not number eight. This is the eight term. So if we count from here, from the starting, then this is why. Uh, is the reason that we are arranging them in order. Okay. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So this is the 8th term is here. Okay. So 8th term means is here means that number is 20. Right. So what can you see there? In the question it was also asked, are they same? Find mode and median of this data. Are they same? So yes, of course. We are getting both of them same. Mode is also 20 and median is also 20. Is it? So, mode is also 20 and median is also 20. Right? Um, uh, at last, what did you do after 8th term? After 8th, I said, this is 8th term. It's not number 8. Now, 8 is not any value for any number. This is giving the 8th term. Okay? So, 8th term means I will count from first here. First term, second term, third term. 
fourth term, fifth term, sixth term, seventh, and then I get my eighth term. Okay. Yes, okay, ma'am. Okay, children. So that's it. This is not value eight. Don't think that the median is eight. If you say that the median is eight, your answer will go wrong. Okay, okay ma'am. Eighth term. With this formula, we get the number, the term value. And if we count the term value, then we get the exact number. Okay? And that number is the answer. All right, children? Hello? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma so, uh, please try such questions from your book. Okay? Just try your book questions today. Okay, Okay, and we'll do some more extra sums in tomorrow's class. Right? So your homework for today is to do the book questions. I'm writing there. Homework. Please do some exercise sums. Do you have mean, median, mode sums in your exercise? Do you have? Check. Ma'am, I don't have NCRT textbook. No, whatever book you have. If you don't yeah. have, then I'll send you. Ma'am, I have the... Uh... My school match textbook. Uh -huh. So just check there if you have mean, median, more. Yes, ma'am. Yeah. Um, but we did not get yet a school book. Okay, so I'll send you some. Never mind. Okay? So don't worry. I'll send you some sums. On the WhatsApp only I'll send you. So you, okay, will, get, you will get your homework on the WhatsApp. Okay? Okay, bye for now. Bye, ma'am. Bye, ma'am. Good night, night. Good night. Thank you, ma'am. Bye, ma'am. Bye, Rita.